down here. Mama, what now? You didn't kiss me goodbye. You gotta let me go. Wait, what is this for? Don't need to know what time it is when I'm on vacation, do I? Bye. I love you both. You can be good now. But don't forget to write. Oh, that was a clip from ABC's Women of the Movement. One mother can make a difference. Of course, a different take on the Emmett Till story. I am joined by one of the actors, Glenn Turman. Glenn, good morning. It's so good to see you today. How you doing? Well, I'm great. I'm great. Good morning. How, how are you? Boy, that was I, a wonderful clip. That's, that's the wonderful is. Adrian Warren, who just won the Tony on Broadway for the Tina Turner story. And she is wonderful. Wait until you see her in this. She is so wonderful with the young Cedric Joe. Cedric Joe playing uh, 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 Emmett Till. It's just a wonderful cast. It really is good to see her come into television screens in this role. But I, I think it's got to be interesting that we're seeing a different take. We're, we're talking about women, especially a mother's love. And maybe people don't realize, you know, you hear the, the tragic and the horrific story of Emmett Till, but yet, his mother was one who tried to continue to risk her life and make changes. As an actor, talk about this different take that maybe we're going to all learn a little something from. Well, I, I, hopefully we learn that, you know, uh, as insignificant as we sometimes think we, we are as individuals in terms of what can, what can be done to change bad situations, this, I think, the message that comes across uh, uh, very strongly to me in this piece is how much one individual uh, can make a difference. You know, this lady uh, had the fury of a, of, a, of a mother who lost her child and was able to take on the nation and change the mores of the nation, you know, as a result, uh, just through the pure love that she had for her, for her child, you know. And um, that's what it takes sometimes. It takes us... Uh, to have the passion um, to correct injustices, you know, and not to think that we can't make a difference, you know. And uh, I, th I hope that's what we come away from uh, uh, watching Women of the Movement. You know what, that's a really good take and one I'm definitely going to take with me. We don't have a lot of time with you. One of the things that I wanted to ask you, though, about your career, you know, going back to A Raisin in the Sun, 1959, you know, with Sidney Poitier, I want to I wanna talk to you about that. When you started out so young in your career and being able to work with such fabulous people, now you are kind of taking on that role and working with youngsters, you know, especially in the women of the movement series. What do you hope to to educate and impose on young actors that you were able to learn from some of the legends as well? Well, one of the one of the great takeaways I got from Mr. Poitier as a youngster is I watched how kind he was with his audience, with his fans, how much he he time he spent with them, how he never took took any of that popularity for granted. And I, through my career, tried to emulate that characteristic. I remember we were in Chicago uh, on trial on the on in Raisin and he came out from backstage from the stage door and it was snowing and the people were standing around in the snow waiting to get his autograph. And he just stood there and he just signed autographs for everybody in that snow. And it was freezing cold, you know. And I remember as a youngster watching him saying, why is he doing that? Why is he standing out there? It's cold. I want to get out of here, you know. <laughs> and uh, But he didn't. He stood there. And I tried to, to take uh, that kind of uh, graciousness away from him. And that's what I try to make these youngsters know. Be gracious. You know, this is a gift you're given. And these, you, you have to uh, not take that for granted. Oh, well, Glenn, we didn't take our time with you for granted. Unfortunately, we are out of time, though. I even wanted to talk about Nate Leahy Sr. and how to get away with murder, but I'm out of time. Oh, I, I want to see yeah. that show come back. But, Glenn, I hope yeah. to talk with you again. And, of course, you can check out this six-episode series Thursdays, ABC, or check out Hulu. Take care. It really was a pleasure.